Greetings, Singularitarians. I'm Haley Lowy, Marketing Lead at SingularityNet. You've probably seen me around or at least read some of my blogs, and I wanted to take a moment today to share with you some of the thoughts I've been reflecting on about the decentralization process and especially the Supervisory Council election and process right now. This is such a key moment for SingularityNet, decentralizing, always the mis mission for SingularityNet, is happening, is unfolding here now with us in this moment. And I think the groundwork is laid perfectly through the ambassador program, through deep funding. The community has already been experimenting and looking in this direction. And now is the moment for the whole organization to begin to decentralize ahead of amazing AGI developments that are in progress right now through OpenCob Hyperon and the wider AI landscape as well. So. As I look at the Supervisory Council election, as I look at the amazing candidates who have come forward for this process, I'm struck with how important diversity is. And this is a, a buzzword sometimes. Diversity needs to be diversity in tech. We can say this a lot, but, but there's something at the root of this that is so important for the decentralization process, for singularity net, for the future of beneficial AI bringing together a diversity of perspectives, a diversity of logic types, a diversity of experiences, a diversity of personalities, is the way that we're going to have an emergent system that is artificially intelligent itself, even if made of, of humans. We're all about this emergence, right? OpenCog Hyperon and the emergent intelligences of AIs working together on a shared knowledge space, the platform and marketplace, the emergent intelligence that can happen when AI agents can collaborate and do more than their individual purposes. And decentralization is, is just as much this disruptive technology as AI or AGI, but, but possibly even younger, more in need of nurturing and growth at this point to bring it to its full potential. And we have that opportunity and these great candidates to do it. We have candidates from all over the world, all types of backgrounds, all kinds of expertise and really exciting visions for how they want to help Singularity Net decentralize. We have um, different genders uh, applying, which is amazing and fantastic and so important. Unfortunately, the experience of being a woman on planet Earth is not yet the same as being a man on planet Earth. And just that diversity of experience and wanting to make sure that all perspectives are brought in and everybody feels equal, included, and welcome within a decentralized organization is so important. If I just look at the, the small subset of, of some of the uh, female candidates that we have right now, we can see this diversity, even in that small subset, uh, Marta is from the uh, University of Brussels and looking at open-ended intelligence, uh, artificial intelligence, AGI, with Kabir and Weaver and, and Ben, and looking at how this intelligence emerges. AGI, of course, is a critical piece of singularity net, and, and her expertise there would offer an amazing perspective on on that component of singularity net grace i had a chance to work with at the decentralization summit she's completely delightful passionate about decentralization the decentralization process helping people feel included and building systems that that bring in participation from all over the world and uh her expertise in that area is it's breathtaking uh, we have Juana. She's a, a deep fund participant since round one. She understands SingularityNet as an organization, SingularityNet's history, deep funds history. She understands the platform from a developer and a, and a product lead perspective, which is so critical. If we only had decentralization experts building the decentralization blueprint, uh, we would miss out on making sure that that blueprint includes the best way forward for decentralizing the platform itself. If we only have AI developers on the Supervisory Council, then we'll miss out on expertise and experience in building DAOs, in drawing communities and in building communities and, and outreaching 
to the whole planet about how they can participate in decentralized AI right now through Singularity Net. And this is just, just, this is just three candidates, just one subset of the amazing set of candidates that we have in front of us to look at and see how we, as a community, want to pull together a team that will be representative of everything Singularity Net stands for and believes in, all our diverse perspectives that can take this new idea of decentralization for Singularity Net, build a foundation that allows decentralization to prosper, to take off and bloom and show the world how decentralization can work in an organization that's got an important mission that's changing the world. So I hope that, that these thoughts help to inspire your own thinking, your own reflectivity on what's important to you in, in supervisory council candidates, in the decentralization process, what questions you have, what you would like to contribute with your own diversity, your own perspectives, your own gifts to this process, to Singularity Net. And I hope that you will join me in meeting the candidates at the Meet the Candidate sessions or watching them uh, hmm. or watching their pre-recorded versions later on and then voting next week for how we can all move together in this emergent process together where all of our efforts can come together as an organization, as a community, as Singularity Net, as the global brain for artificial intelligence. Thank you.